Hello dear student. How are you today? Today in Unit 1, Lesson 4, we are going to, going to talk about one of the tenses in English language, which is past simple tense. Let's get started. Past simple in use. It means we use past simple for things that happened at a specific time in the past. Or we can say we use past simple for a series of complete actions in the past. Look at this infographic here. We have th three different types or times here. We have past and now and the future. When we say past, we talked about this period of time. And also we have some common expressions that we use them in the past simple chance. They are yesterday, last week or last year, last month and ago. We can say one week ago, two month, months ago, or five years ago. And also we have a specific time, like in 2010, and so on. Forms of past simple. We, generally, we have two forms of past simple. We have was, where, from, and regular and irregular uh, form. Today, we focus it. We are going to talk about the regular and irregular uh, form. I mean, we talked about it past simple with the main verb. Look at these two examples. I went to school yesterday and I paid for dinner last week. They are in the past simple tense. Regular and irregular verbs form, we start from the positive form. At the beginning, we have subject and after subject, we have verb pass and then we have complement. Look at these examples. There is no class classification as a, we have in present simple with the subject is. After this subject, we have the main verb in the past form. For example, you can say he visited his friend yesterday and she studied hard last night and we can say he bought a bike or we can say I bought a bike. Look at these uh, verbs here. Visit, studied and bought. Visit and studied they are regular verb and bought is irregular verb. So let me show you what do you mean by regular and irregular verbs. These are lists of regular verbs. It means that regular verbs are those verbs that can take ed when we change them, them from the present to the past form. Look at here, we, we have watch, became watched, walk, walk it, look, look it, want, want it, and visit, visit it, and end it, study, studied. They are regular verbs because they can take ed when we change the, them from the present to the past. But irregular verb, it means they cannot take ed. We do not have a specific rule uh, for them when we change them from the present to the past. Look at this example. Go, became, went. Doesn't take ed and we do not have a specific rule here. Speak, spoke, write, wrote, understand, understood. Forget, forgot, drive, drove, and give, gave. Let's come back to the forms of past simple. How can we negate past simple tense? We just add the didn't. It means at the beginning we have subject and then we have the didn't. After didn't, be careful we have or we should use the base form of the verb because we have the then we do not use the past form of the verb here and then we have complement we have examples here look we can say i didn't play tennis last weekend or we can say you didn't play tennis he didn't play tennis last weekend here we use play and we can say we use the base form of the verb which is play because we have the then we cannot say played Another example, we can say she didn't clean the window. We have to say clean. We cannot say clean it because we have didn't here. And 
we or we can say we didn't go the dentist or we can say you didn't go the dentist after then we have to use the base form of the verb which is go we cannot say went because we have didn't and the question form is that we move did and put at the beginning of the sentence and then we have subject also uh, the verb should be in base and then we have complaint be careful at the end uh, we have question mark we have examples here did for example we can say did he work in the garden yesterday did she work in the garden yesterday we say work not work it because we have did here we use the base form of the verb which is work and also you can answer this question by short answer you can say yes i did no i didn't another example did she dance at the party last night we have to say dance not dance it because we have did as i said and we have another example here you can say did they play tennis last weekend we say play not played because we have did And also we have WH question word. When we have WH question word, we put the WH question word uh, before uh, did. It means at the initial or the beginning of the sentence. We say, when did you work in the garden? Or we can say, uh, how did you work in the garden? Or we can say, where did you work? This is the question form with WH question words. The summary we use the past simple tense for completed action is in the past. This is the general rule of past simple. We have subject and the verb uh, with the past form and then we have complement. Look at this example. The positive form is that he went to the park yesterday. How can we negate? We just add didn't. We say he didn't. The verb should be in base. Go. When became go. We say he didn't go to the park yesterday and the question form did he go to the park yesterday and also the question form with W's question where this we say when did he go to the park. That's all. Thanks for your watching and listening.